Walking Dead, Ones Who Live comparison shows how lucky Rick was Mikon didn't kill him. A side-by-side -side comparison of the reunion in The Walking Dead, The Ones Who Live has revealed just how close Mikon came to killing Rick. The pair finally found one another after Nat blew up an approaching CRM helicopter, revealing Rick to be one of the soldiers inside. While Mikon killed the other soldiers, she ended up taking his helmet off, just in time to stop herself. Now, you slash plastic underscore airy underscore 1007 has posted a video of Rick and Mikon's The Ones Who Live reunion, comparing the scene from both of their perspectives. The side-by-side -side of episodes 1 and 2 reveal just how close Mikon came to killing Rick, thinking of her family as she murdered the CRM soldiers. If she hadn't taken off Rick's helmet, he would no doubt be dead, leading to a tragic moment for the show. What to expect from Rick and Mikon's escape plan? After finally reuniting, Rick is forced to take Mikon captive, the CRM approaching too fast for them to get away in time. To keep her true associations with him a secret, she takes on the name Dana, working as a consignee while plotting an escape. However, their plan has a setback in the form of Jodies, who knows her real identity and confronts Rick about it at the end of episode 2. However, Rick and Jodies have a deal, the details of which seemingly prevent her from going to the higher UPS of the CRM right away. Depending on how he's able to handle his new plan to get back home, he may be able to circumvent any threat she may pose. Though it's clear whatever deal the pair made could put the core couple's future in jeopardy, especially once it's revealed what the details of their deal are. Since Jodies knows where Alexandria is, Rick and Mikon's only chance of escape may be to kill her to keep her from talking to CRM members like Bale. It's also possible the pair will fake their deaths, fully preventing the massive group from ever finding out where the Virginia communities are. With four episodes left in The Ones Who Live, though, it may take another episode or two for their escape plan to be fully realized.